Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Ryan and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, I'll be showing you a pretty cool new trolling glitch in GTA Online, which will allow you to look like you're driving backwards. So before I start the video, I would ask that anyone who enjoys this video, please make sure to leave a like rating before you leave, and also make sure to subscribe so you'll never miss a future video from me when I post regarding GTA, and also make sure to check out the founder who is also in the description below. So basically what this glitch will allow you to do is the person who shoots the guy who's doing the glitch will be able to see this, but everyone else will not be able to see it. The person being shot is also just normal, he will not see any change. The only person who sees a change and sees this glitch is the person who shot the guy. So as you guys saw there, I did this glitch with my friend, and my friend was flying the cargo bob, and as you guys saw, he looked like he was flying with his ass. So what your friend wants to do is he wants to hold down on the d-pad so it brings up the character menu, and he wants to pick any character, and he wants to switch to it. It'll then give him a prompt saying, are you sure you want to switch or leave the session? And this is where the timing actually comes in and is very crucial, because as soon as he presses B or no to back out of that prompt, then your friend or the guy doing this glitch needs to shoot him in the head with a sniper rifle. If done correctly, the guy who is actually being shot will start blinking, but he will fall down to the ground and die, and as you guys see here, his body will be like this. Now all your friend will need to do is get on any vehicle, such as a bike, a cargo bob, and you know, anything like that, and his body should be messed up. So now once we've done it correctly, you'll see that my friend, he got on the bike once he spawned back in. He looks like he's driving backwards or he's driving with his ass. He is a stick figure basically or a character model and he will stay like this until he falls off or gets killed. Another cool factor about this glitch is that you can actually kill your friend anywhere by shooting his body which was originally dropped. So for instance, if your friend is on the beach but you're on the other part of the map and you actually shoot his body which fell or that original time you know, where he fell and he's a stick figure on the ground, if you shoot that body enough times, it will actually kill his real life person who is alive now. I'm now going to demonstrate from the other perspective or the person being shot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold down on the d-pad, switch to any character, and you'll then get this prompt saying, are you sure you want to quit? Now as soon as you hit the B button, you want to make sure your friend shoots you in the face. And if done correctly, you should take a little bit of damage, but you still should be alive. Your friend will be able to tell you if you are you know, on the ground and you are glitching out funny, but if you're not, your friend still should see you blinking and you should be normal. Just do the glitch again and you should have no problem getting this right. So I hope this video has helped you. If it did, please make sure to leave a like before you leave as it will help me get my video out there. Also, if you're still watching the video, please make sure to leave me a comment saying Dahi. I actually showed him this at the time of recording and he actually is gonna upload this. So if you guys see this on his channel or from any other crew, um, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and also the founder who's in my description as well because we post the latest and the greatest GTA 5 content and I would love to have you guys on my channel. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video and I hope to see you in my future videos. But until next time, my name is Ryan and I'm out. Peace.